offices in Vancouver, Washington, consists of 21 historically restored homes built for United States Army officers and their families. In 1849, the Army arrived in Vancouver with 76 soldiers. The buildings put up during those early years were built as quickly as possible, and the carpenters were forced out of necessity to use green logs and planks. This resulted as the wood dried in large gaps between the logs, and this made for very cold and uncomfortable housing during much of the year. The first building, constructed in 1849, was for the post commander's residence and command headquarters. This building would later become known as the Grant House. In those early years, better housing was a low priority, and it would be five years before even the commander's post was made more livable. New homes were built as needed over a period of 50 years, with the last one being constructed in, in 1906. A home on Officers Row became a coveted prize for an officer and his family. One drawback to the life, though, was the constant flux of moving. Not only were soldiers reassigned at a moment's notice, but a major home move could happen simply if a higher-ranking officer and his family arrived, then they would be entitled to take over a house, even if another family was living there. This also happened if important guests needed housing for short periods of time. In some cases, a family already in the home might have to move with just one or two days' notice. Still, military families have a long tradition of building tight social structures of support and encouragement, and here on Officers Row, that was no exception. A week's social calendar could include a dinner party, a dance, a card party, a singing and music evening, horse riding, and simply a walk along Officers Row with friends to talk, to talk and share. Over a span of 160 years that the Army was in Vancouver, some 70 officers would go on to become Army generals. Three of them had homes named in their honor, the Grant House, the Marshall House, and the Howard House. Today you can take a tour, walk through the hallways, and peek into historically restored rooms of the Marshall and Howard Houses. You can enjoy a delicious meal at the Grant House Eatery, as well as book a private, corporate, or social event.